An explosion rattles downtown Franklin as a fire burns a well-known restaurant. Flames broke out about 7.30 this morning at Smith's PH Bistro. That's in the 500 block of South Main Street. Pam Elliott shows you the startling video captured by an eyewitness. This is how dangerous it got for firefighters. What appeared to be a bomb going off inside this building was really a backdraft from a fire that just would not quit. I tried to make an interior entry. As soon as they did, uh, there was a backdraft explosion. Uh, caused all the windows out of the front of the building to explode outward on the crews. Franklin's fire chief, Jonathan Westendorf, got some help from crews in Lebanon and Miami Township after Smith's PH Bistro started to burn before 8 a.m. They put ladders on every side of the building and used a lot of water. The owner of the popular hangout told 2 News he barely escaped the fire. His home was on top of his business. Missy, the girl that has the hair place next door, I could hear her screaming. I woke up and then there was nothing but smoke, so I ran around and trying to see if I could grab something. And then I just ran out the door. I had all my shorts and a t-shirt. and. Um, by the time I got around the front of the building, I could, the window was popping and cracking like popcorn. You could hear it, and then I got past, and it blew up like an explosion. Like the so. building has quite a history. It used to be Kinney's. Tim Smith says he took it over four years ago. It was known for its pizza. Yeah, I brought my camera, a lot of memories, just hoping everybody can stick together and still meet up with each other every weekend. and. Hopefully, Tim's all right and has somewhere to go. I did ask Smith about that. He said the Red Cross was helping him with a place to stay. But his business and belongings are gone. Not only his loss, but the community's. It's one of our historic buildings, so we, we hate to see it go. The, you know, the great thing is no one was hurt, so buildings can be replaced. Smith says he needs time to decide if the bistro will be back. Cam Elliott, 2 News on your side.